There is no reason your cat's carrier should be their worst enemy, and yet that is almost always the case. There's a better way. Work with your cat's instincts instead of against them. So you guys bring that carrier out and try to jam them in it on the day of your visit. You're anxious and they're terrified. So they only associate the carrier with bad things and somebody ends up bleeding. Not exactly a great start for you or your cat or the vet. Instead, get a carrier that you want to be part of your home decor. Leave it out 24 seven in a convenient spot and throw in a treat or two every day. So now your cat associates the carrier with comfort and safety, not terror. You can even zip them inside and take them for a walk around the house every now and then. So on vet day, your cat's not terrorized. It's just a treat inside. Your cat jumps in, zip and go. And remember, hold the carrier from the bottom. Don't swing them around. There's a cat in there. And when you get to the vet, don't grab or pull them out. That is scary. Just remove the lid and let your cat, easier said than done, let your cat be examined from inside their safe bed. So now your trips to the vet will be off on the right paw. So make an appointment and take